Hi guys, uh, this is Raymond from EV Offer and Amtech. Today we will talk uh, about the uh, recent recall for the Model S uh, regarding the front issue. Uh, so you might already heard about it. Uh, Tesla uh, yesterday just announced a recall for the Model S. Uh, the cause affected is the Model S uh, from 2014 uh, for dual motor and all the car from 2015 through 2021 before the Pet S. Um, so let me try to explain what the problem is and how you can check if your pro car has the, the, the problem. So let me try to pop open the front first. So I don't have an electric front with me right now. So uh, this is an OEM system. Um, so let me try to explain here. I already removed this little cover so we can see the latch here. So uh, when you uh, on the hood, this is what we call a striker. So when the hood goes down, you will do the latching. Uh, uh, the striker will go all the way down to here. It lands in here. So when you continue to push down the hood, you will do the primary latching like this. So you you will pull you will pull pull down. So like this. Oops. Uh, let me use my finger. So, so I push down the latch, yes, so. so you can see as the primary latch is engaged, the secondary latch will also engage itself. So, so uh, your striker will be hooked by the primary latch under here. And at the same time, the secondary latch is also in action. So uh, this is uh, an extra safety feature uh, when your car is driving and if something accidentally hit the button here, the front re emergency release button here, the primary latch will get unlatched actually, but the secondary latch will not let go if you are driving. This is a safety feature designed by Tesla. Uh, we already explained this feature in uh, one of our previous video. You can watch it. Uh, we have a better this uh, this. Uh, better explanation there but yeah this is the secondary latch that we talk about um, so uh, what the program described by Tesla is that when the hook goes down here it cannot be hooked by this latch so it cannot be hooked by here the reason is that the, the latch is misaligned and is installed in a relatively rear location so the, the, the secondary latch actually goes here so you, it cannot hook into the to the striker, so it offers no protection uh, to the hood if something accidentally hit the hit the button inside the front. So so uh, to check it is very easy. So uh, in our car we can demonstrate uh, how the the latch is hooked uh, that the striker is hooked by the latch. So you can see from here it can hook by the latch and it will not let go if the car is driving and something hit the button uh, of course if you if you try to unlatch using your key fob this one will go will let, let go at the same time as the primary latch so so uh the way to check if your car has the problem is very simple so uh you need to use some screwdriver or uh, to do the latching like this so you, you let the system latch already so this will engage automatically as well uh, if you don't have enough force to push down the latch by hand or by two you can wait actually the secondary latch will engage if the front is left open for for a few minutes so you can wait until the latch uh, the, the latch uh, usually will look like this yeah and if you close the latch this one will go here uh, the secondary latch will engage so if you cannot uh, do not have enough force to do the primary latch by hand you can just wait until this one goes to here then now you can lower the hood if you have an electric front just stop it before you hit the, the bottom just stop it and then let it land like this after it land so try to pull up so right now you can see it's not completely latched we can still a big gap because it's it's just landed bit without the, the final latching so try to pull it if you can pull it up fully that means the secondary latch cannot be hooked uh, no the, the tracker cannot be hooked by the by the secondary latch but if you cannot pull it up that means your car is good so you're safe 
and you probably don't need to go back to Tesla for the recall but of course you can advise your service uh, advisor in Tesla service center but this is the idea of it this is what uh, Tesla described on the program regarding the recall service so it's very easy to check uh, just um, just let's let, let this this secondary latch engage first and then uh, pull the hood down and see if it can be hooked by the by the uh, the, the striker can be hooked by this one so uh, I hope you understand what this this uh, this video is about yeah I hope you like it and uh, thank you